Hello, students, and welcome back to the English Danny channel. Today, I've got a new episode of Three-Way English with Dr. Dom. But before I get into the story, let me remind viewers to subscribe to our channel if you're enjoying this content. And if you find this video helpful, please like and share it since it helps our channel a lot. Thank you. Let's start the episode. Remember, with three-way English, I will tell you a story three different ways. First, in a very basic, simple way, and then twice more with increasing difficulty. The idea is to help you learn English grammar and vocabulary in context. The first time through, I will use simple present tense only. I will use simple sentence structures and speak slowly with no contractions. Today's story is the fox and the goat. A fox falls into a well one day and is not able to get out. After a long time, a goat comes by the well. The goat is thirsty. He thinks the fox is in the well to drink the water. He asks the fox if the water is any good. The fox says it is, so the goat jumps in and starts drinking. The fox jumps on the goat's back and from there jumps out of the well. The goat now realizes he is stuck and he begs the fox to help him out. But the fox is already running into the woods. He tells the goat, he needs to be more cautious before he jumps into a situation he does not understand. Okay, now let's do the story a second time through. This time I will introduce different verb tenses such as the simple past. I will use some different vocabulary and sentence structures, and I will speak a little faster than the first time through. A fox fell into a well one day and couldn't get back out again. After a long time, a thirsty goat came by looking for something to drink. The goat asked the fox if the water in the well was any good. The crafty fox replied that the water was delicious. The goat jumped in and started drinking, but at the same time, the fox jumped onto his back and then scrambled up out of the well. The goat quickly realized he was stuck and begged the fox to come help him out. But the fox was already well on his way into the woods. As he ran, he called out over his shoulder that the goat should be more cautious before jumping into situations he doesn't understand. All right, well now you know the story. So I'm going to do it one more time, this time at something close to native level speed and with more advanced vocabulary and sentence structures. One day, a fox fell into a well and couldn't get himself out again. He lay there for a long time before a thirsty goat happened by looking for something to drink. How's the water? The goat asked little suspecting what a predicament the fox was in. It's fine, the sly fox replied, the finest in the whole valley. So the goat jumped in and started to lap up the water. But as he did, the fox leapt onto his back and from there was able to scramble up out of the well and run away. Realizing his plight, the goat cried out, come help me, Mr. Fox. But the fox was already well on his way into the woods. If you had any more sense, my friend, you would have checked more carefully before you dove in. And the moral of this story is, look before you leap. Don't forget to like and share this video if you found it helpful. Subscribe to our channel to keep enjoying content like this. And if you want to learn more, you can check out one of my three-way English courses that I've put on Udemy. These courses dive into these stories in more detail, showing you the grammar, vocabulary, sentences, and expressions you can learn 
from the stories. Hope to see you there, and I will definitely see you in the next video.